If we take Anthony Joshua's statements to heart, the heavyweight division might witness some electrifying and thrilling nights in the years ahead. The two-time unified champion recently engaged in a conversation with TNT's Laura Woods to promote his upcoming fight against Otto Wallen on the highly anticipated Day of Reckoning card in Saudi Arabia. When asked to sum up Tyson Fury, Francis Ngannou, and Deontay Wilder with a single word and then describe potential fights with them, Joshua offered candid insights beyond the usual narratives. Describing Fury as a diva, Joshua openly discussed how he envisions defeating the Gypsy King when their paths cross. In Joshua's words, facing Fury would be a good fight, emphasizing his speed, strength, and explosive knockout ability. He confidently stated that Fury couldn't lean on him or throw him around, asserting, No, it won't be early, he's a good fighter, but I'll be there. I'll be there 100%. Turning to Francis Ngannou, the former UFC heavyweight champion who made waves by challenging Fury in their crossover event, Joshua expressed admiration, calling Ngannou an inspiration due to his incredible story. Joshua envisioned a war in the ring, declaring, the first man to land is going out, and dismissed the idea of Fury competing, stating, Tyson Fury can stay at home. Lastly, Joshua addressed his longtime rival Deontay Wilder, the WBC champion and co-star for the upcoming event. Despite their lengthy dance around each other in the boxing world, Joshua and Wilder seemed destined for a showdown if they both succeed in their upcoming challenges. Describing Wilder as bronze in a clever play on the Bronze Bomber nickname, Joshua hinted at a matchup between the two explosive heavyweights. While unsure if Wilder hits harder than Ganu, Joshua anticipated a short, violent affair in the ring, underlining the potential explosiveness of a clash between the two renowned fighters.